भाई क्या What is it? Long time no see. Do we know you? I'm Guybrush. You tried to sell me the minutes of a PTA meeting in the last game, claiming it was a map. Map? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. No, really. Why did you wake us up, Gorbush? What happened to your leg? It happened during a performance. That's what we do for a living now. You see, after our circus failed, we started a pirate catering business on nearby Fat Island. The sacking lunch. It was quite lucrative. Why aren't you still doing that? The governor of the island made us an offer we uh <laughs> couldn't refuse. So we sold him the business. What did you do with the money? We sank the money into one of those newfangled glass bottom boats. We wanted to take passengers on sightseeing trips and search for a place called Drinky Island in our spare time. Boy, did we ever want to get there! Aside from the obvious reason, we had inside information that Drinky was in fact the resting place of the legendary treasure of Big Wolf. Big whoop? I'm looking for that too! Well, I hope your luck is better than ours. You see, we got a bit of a raw deal on the boat. Seems the salesman didn't have any glass for the bottom, so we just left a gaping hole there. By the time we noticed, we were taking on water, fast. We ended up stranded on a tiny desert island. When do we get to the performing part? We met a philosopher on the island, and he told us something which changed our lives. What? What is it? What did he say? Tell me already! He told us that all the world is a stage and that we are merely players. So, we became performance artists. But when he lost the leg, Frank was brilliantly showing the inseparability of the path man walks from the food chain. The symbolism of the cheese was essential. You know, this leg is looking sort of dingy. Would you get some polish over at the woodsmiths and polish it for me? Sure. Thanks. Here's some money for the polish. See you later. We can scarcely contain our anticipation. Buy some wood polish? That's one piece of eight. Anything else? I'd just like to browse, thanks. Okay, but don't touch anything. Give you a piece of eight, but uh, <laughs> I'm fresh out. Thanks. I'd give you a piece of eight, but uh, <laughs> I'm fresh out. Uh, 
I don't think that'll work. Wow, a whole bucket of mud. And it's mine, all mine. I hear Largo coming. Hey, what the hell? What's going on? Whoever did this is gonna pay. I can't get this thing off my head. When I get this thing off my head, somebody's gonna be real sorry. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. He looked pretty steamed. You're making me mad, Marty! That's my name, don't wear it out! Look, I want it free and I want it tonight! Party tonight? Sure, I'll come! I'm talking about getting my laundry! Don't worry about me, I've been dry for three years! I said, I need it back tonight! What? Yeah, we'll stay out all night! This is useless! You tell them I'll be back to pick it up! Or else. I'd like to pick up some clothes. You have your claim ticket, Sonny. It was stolen. Taking it bowling was a dumb thing to do. What do you know about Largo Legrand? I don't know anything about cargo or contraband. I'm clean, clean, clean! I'd like to pick up some clothes. You have your claim ticket, Sonny. Mom threw it out when she cleaned my room. What? You beat your mom with a broom? You should treat her better than that. I'd like to pick up some clothes. You have your claim ticket, Sonny. I dropped it in my grog and it melted. Log welted it? Well, now that is a good excuse. But I can't give you your clothes without a claim ticket. I'd like to pick up some clothes. You have your claim ticket, Sonny. I lost it while being keel-hauled. Your dog got mauled? What does that have to do with a claim ticket? Oh, never mind. I'd like to pick up some clothes. You have your claim ticket, Sonny. I must have left it in my other pants. Why'd you trade it for chocolate-covered ants? I'd like to pick up some clothes. You have your claim ticket, Sonny. No, I don't have my claim ticket. You don't have to shout at me. I can hear you. But I can't give you your clothes without a claim ticket. Who are you? Sure, Sonny, I can get out stew. That's easy. I can also extract grog, spit, and swamp mud. That's because I'm mad, Marty. I'm mad about getting your clothes the clean as they can be. I got a laundry type question. Shoot. Do you do alterations here? Alterations? You mean change the numbers on your food stamps? You got some nerve. Uh, I'm sorry. I've got a laundry type question. Shoot. 
would you be able to get out ketchup? Get out ketchup? What do you want me to do? Uh, nothing. Oops, I thought I wanted to talk to you, but I don't. 